Hello. How y'all doing? What's good? What's up? How you feeling? You getting up, getting out, getting into something. Hey, baby, I hope so. It's me, Mama Roxy. Yeah, I'm sitting here with my, oh, my boot on. I had to prop my feet up, my foot up. If you ask me how I'm doing, I'm feeling okay. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm up. I'm out. I'm busy and all of that stuff. And, and I have no complaints, y'all. I really don't. I really don't. Uh, I'm here. He woke me up this morning. Let me go to bed last night. My sister Denise came over and hung out with me. And we even went to the store. <laughs> yeah, I got stir crazy. I got tired of being in the house. Uh, you still ask me. I had my surgery Tuesday. But I they asked that I keep my little bands on just in case I have any medical issues or need to go right away. So I keep my little bands on for a couple of days. They come off today. Um, let's see what else. Surgery went fine. Uh, my foot. They say we're supposed to to stay numbed up for at least 48 hours, something like that. No, not mine. Because I wasn't able to eat, when I don't eat and I don't drink water, I get muscle spasms. And my muscle spasms last for hours and hours. And then afterwards... Everything be so intense and tightened and, and everything. So I had a muscle spasm in both feet. Even the one that I had the surgery in, good Lord Jesus. It was so painful. It knocked out all the meds that were in there. So I feel everything. It's a hot mess, but I'm here. I'm still making it. It ain't stopping no show. None whatsoever. I just need to rest. A lot because the pain is so so terrible. But this is Mama Roxy says I'm here for your wallet, your purses, and your pocketbooks, baby, your hearts, and your minds. Yes, but that's how everything been going. I'm in a lot of pain. It's very very achy. He shaved the bone down on the side. I had bone spurs underneath, and I had a bunion. So he had to go in there and he had to take that. And it was so large that I was walking on the bottom of it. It was walking on. So he had to take that and I got a, some stitches on the top. I got a stint in there. It's all types of stitch, stuff that's going on with that. But I've been down. I went to Walmart the first day. Yep, I went to Walmart. I had to go get my prescriptions. And they give you narco and ibuprofen and since I've had that gastro bypass no leave no Motrin and no ibuprofen can't take none of those they mess up the stomach so I couldn't take that so I just got that narco that they gave me and some regular Tylenol that I take do it work a little bit just a little bit but anyway I've been to Walmart I'll do that in another haul. I'm going to do the Dollar Tree right now. So I've been to Dollar Tree. Y'all know. I got me some Chester's Papa's Cheddar White Worlds. Cheddar Worlds. Got me some hugs. Now, everybody in my house, except for my youngest son, which is Clifford, that got married, and my daughter, Lizella, which is my oldest daughter, they don't drink coffee. They uh, he drink they drink tea, but no coffee. And she drinks coke. I want some cocoa. So I went and got some Swiss Miss Instant Cocoa with marshmallow. I went and got those. And you get six packs in here. Y'all know, okay? I'm a gum freak. I eat gum all the time. And it suppresses my appetite when I want something kind of sweet or I don't have anything or I just know I'm eating too much. I have to stuff some gum in my mouth. So I got me some extra. I got me two of those. And you get a four pack in here. And I like these. This is the 
Why I always come here and got no glasses? This, I like that. That's the bubblegum flavor. This one right here is the long lasting Wrigley. This is the polar ice one. Double mint. This one is, is this the same one? No, this one is the peppermint one. And this one is the spearmint. I love gum, period. It suppresses my appetite. Or like I know if I didn't eat it about 30 minutes ago and I get hungry, then I pop me some gum in my mouth and my gum will be fine. All right. Y'all know I live for this water. I love these waters. So I got me some of these. These are the Nestle Splash. This is lemon. You get four instead of the six at the Dollar Tree. I got two of those. And I got two of these. And these are the wild berry flash. Okay. I gotta reach for stuff, y'all. Because everything is so spread apart over here, right? Okay, hold on. I'm coming. A little bit out of breath. But it's good. We went to two different Dollar Trees yesterday. So, some more gum. I got this at 15 piece. And it's the Trident Splash. And I got the Dent Ice. I got that one. I got another Dent Ice. I got the Trident. And this is the Spearmint Pad. Yeah, you know, I'm keeping me some gum. You're going to hear my grandson I'm coming in in a minute. Y'all, I wanted these plates. Look at them. I, and these are Royal Nork. Nork for, I can't see the little. Look at that. Look at that. Those were so pretty. It got the hot cocoa. It got the little candy canes, the donuts, the little sugars. It just so cute. I got me two of those. Y'all. Look. These right here have yourself a merry little Christmas. Look at that. That is absolutely gorgeous. And these are my colors that's in my kitchen. So I got two of each. I was so happy when I came in. And then in the other one, cookies. Santa. Look at that. I love those. I got that one. I got another cookie for Santa. And I got Tis the Season. You know when everybody's sitting around having a little coffee or whatever, you can um, put their little cookies or little crackers or little toast or whatever it is that they have in there. Hold on, y'all. I think they here. I got a lot to roll to. I'm trying not to put my foot down because it hurts so bad. Okay, so hold on. I'm coming. So you know in my front room, it's blue and silvers and whites. Look at those. Just to go along the little wall or something. Ain't that cute? These are window clings. You can put them anywhere you want to put them up. Nope, she gone. She left. You always got to keep one of these. So this is the neat um, multi-purpose lighter. It's the refillable. I don't know where you get the refillable stuff from. Huh? 
Good morning. Good morning. How are you? All right, y'all. My grandsons came in, and he brought me some chips. <laughs> brought me some chips. Yes. I got me some Pringles. I love salt and vinegar chips. I really do. Say hi, Kim. The come on in and speak. How everything been going, little man? Good. How is school going? I ain't going to school. I know you ain't going to school. Day Saturday, ding dong. Oh, good. But how, when you do go to school, how is it? Good. All right. That's a good thing. You made some new friends? Yes. Okay. That's good. You good, dog? Mm -hmm. You been sick was a was it a, like two weeks ago? You all right now? Ah, oh, you look so handsome. You so weird. <laughs> all right, go ahead watch TV. All right, y'all, back to back to the drawing board. All right, so then I found some of these. Look at the snowflakes. Tell me these not pretty. Let me put them up. The camera ain't doing them no justice. So I got like four of these. They go over there in that stash. Is there. So then, I just so happened to see some Pro Marks multi purpose spray glue. I ain't never seen this before. Extra strength, acid free, and dries clear. So I got some of that. It's a couple of little projects that I wanna I wanna do. My uh sister Denise, she been doing some amazing little projects. I don't know why she don't videotape them. We gonna videotape them soon. Watch. So then I got some praying. I, I might be saying it wrong. This is a washable wash ready to use tempered paint and. I got it in this red. What is the name of this one? This is the eight ounce and somebody's TV or something is too loud. I got it in that red. I got it in this black. So then y'all, I needed some batteries. You know I'm gonna show y'all in a minute what I what I'm using these for. These are the super heavy duty E Circuit D1.5 V. I got these. And I got some cute little brushes. Look at them. These are the chunky brushes. So I got those. You get three of those. And these are by Crafters Square. Now, one of these things are to I got to redo them. <laughs> See, he's so old. I got to take all of this off. And I think I'm just going to wipe them down because this red is pretty good. And you got this little Christmas sign, which I may change. But everything else is good. I got to take all of this off, put it back on there, and then fix his little hat on there. Make him like a little face lift, you feel me? So that's what that red paint is for. So then, when I get... I've been watching... Since I've been in the house laid up, even when I ain't laid up, I watch a lot of YouTube. And I've been watching people do their Christmas trees and the little ideas. One lady stuck poinsettias in her trees, which are these. And these are just the white ones. See that? That's going to be so pretty in that tree. And I've I seen them use these. Look at those. These right here are called the ferns. And they just got that flocking stuff on there to make them white. Do y'all know I'm all about some gold, boo? Look at this gold. Oh, and it's just everywhere. Look at it. This is the gold fern. I like those. And I got me a couple of more of those white poinsettias. And I got some of this white garland. It's the snowflake garland that I'm going to use to trim out stuff with as well. I'm trying not to get so glittered up. But it don't help. Look, I got it on forehead already. So then, y'all, I've seen them where they made 
uh, they put little stuffed animals and different little things in the tree. I thought it was going to look kind of childish like, but it wasn't. It was very elegant and pretty. So I found him and he all white. Look at this. White and gold. He going to sit in little parts of the tree. I got like three or four of these. That's Santa. So then some little gold little these are hanging up all around my room I got them over here over there they just everywhere and I like these these are by Seasons Goods Christmas House and I got like three of those you can put them on little trays you can do all of that with them oh no oh no oh no I just gotta glue him back together just like this once I glue him together You'll be just fine. They can really go this way like this. Yep, moving back together. And I got these two. I got some glitter vase. But, Phyllis, right? I've seen a lady take them little plain little Christmas trees and put little Christmas balls on them. So I like that too. I got it in this color right here. It's a hundred and... 10 pieces I got it in this white and gold and silver and gold so then I found this this is a man's grooming kit for his nails and everything hair whatever you need it for that's what it is and you get four pieces a comb the tweezers the little hair cutter trimmer and some nail clippers Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> and I got me, my cousin bought me all of this stuff. I don't know where the heck of a jackman is. And this is a foot file to do the bottom of your feet. I'm gonna tell y'all, I'm used to doing my own feet and my own nails, right? I like going to get my nails done at the shop because they last so much longer than they do when I just take the glue and I glue my own little Lee press on nails on there. My nose itch. It take, this G's been on for like two or three weeks, so close to a month, and they still going strong. I like that. But when they do my toes, my toes hurt afterwards. Then it seemed like, y'all, when I soak my foot, I soak my foot and done dishwashing liquid. And I use a little apple cider vinegar, or you could use that blue Listerine, and that gets all the dead skin. And then you gotta massage it. And then once you massage it, you use a little rake to scrape all the little dead ends off of it, the dead skin. And then I lotion them down and put some socks on there. My feet stay soft forever. But every time I go get my feet done at the shop, I gotta come, I gotta go back. Within about a week or two, I gotta go back. The skin is peeling. It's, it's, it's a hot, it feels a mess. So I got me some of these Crafter Square glue sticks. I got me two of these. And you get 20 a piece in there. I swear, I'll be so mad when I go in there. I'm like, what is going on? Why? <laughs> I swear you gotta come back. So then, I started watching... I, I love watching the Robeson. Um, I can't think of her name right quick. I'm going to tell you what her name is. I watch her as much and as often as possible. And I'm going to tell you what her name is. My history. And it's... Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. It's the Ken Woven. The Robesons. I love watching her and her and she and her and her daughter they decorate. Oh my goodness. They are fun. And I've been watching other people decorate too. And they've been using these little fillers on their little trees to make their trees look fuller. I like that. I got me like two packs of those. So then for the hair that's on my little man right here, I'm gonna take this off and I'm gonna use them and just spread them out. And I and I like those. This is what I'm gonna use. This is a mop head. So then in the Robinson, she was talking about 
uh, taking a few of your uh, Christmas balls and you rope them together and you make a ball cluster. And I got me some of these to do that as well. And this have you eaten? What you eat? And these are the tinsel stems. You get 45 pieces in here. I'm trying to think. What you eat? Leave that alone. It's taking you that long to think? Good Lord Jesus. So I also got some black ones. So you won't be able to see. I got those. And these are the chenille stems. And I got me some of that. These little paint brushes right here, and they the sponge gabbers. So I can do that. And you get that's three. So that means you need something to eat if you can't remember. I got me some more of these. I'm gonna show you where they go in a minute. I also got some silver ones as well. And and this is the small version. The C. These are the C's. And I was only able, y'all, to find two of the trees. I need about seven more of these so I can make a tall, skinny six-foot tree. I need that. Can't find that. So I just got two. And I got some things to hang your wreaths over the door. I got me two gold ones. So let me show y'all. Let me show y'all. Hold on, y'all. This is a part of my Christmas decor. Yes. Oh, you're missing a tooth, man. How does it feel? You feel okay? Until you got to take care of that because Granny, remember? That's your teeth up. Okay, y'all. This I bought so many years ago, right? It needs to be cleaned real bad. What is that called? I'm finna show you if you give me a minute. I bought it from Goodwill or Salvation Army. It's one of them. So many years ago. And I just used it to, uh, just for decor. But since I got the grandbabies, I'm getting so much older. And everything, I just really, really, and truly want to go out all this Christmas and just bring that Christmas like I had when I used to live in Chicago. Honey, my mama would do Christmas up. The you only thing. Come with us for Halloween. No, I didn't come. It was too cold, baby. You, you got wet, didn't oh, you? Oh, yeah, we got poured on. That's right. I would have had pneumonia messing around with y'all out there. I can't we do all of that. Like 50 oh no, Nanny wasn't doing all of that, baby. That's too. That's too much. I don't like getting cold, and I don't like being wet. If it ain't in the summertime, if it ain't out there in the summertime, and I'm getting in some water so or the pool. Oh, no, I'm Nanny ain't broken. trying to do all of that, baby. Nanny can't stand being cold. I don't do cold. Y'all trying to get the dang on thing out the school. I don't even want to come out there, though. You need... How many? 1.5. Oh, man. I didn't buy enough, so I got to go back and get some more of these. These are too big. So I got to go back and get two more of these. Who? You got some paint stuff? Yeah, I got to paint my little people right here. So I got to go back and get some more of these batteries. I just knew the D was going to be just a fan. The D. <laughs> was going to be fan. But nope, I need the C. Oh, oh, my. Can you kind of like come help me though? <laughs> you see I'm only working with one foot. Okay. That's good. My light, Jossie, my light fall over. <laughs> so I need to have... Another pack of these. Man, to make them work. I'm so mad right now. But these are just too big. I need seeds. So, y'all gonna have to come back now, you hear? 
I wanted to show y'all, but it's not working that way. But I love you all. You guys have a beautiful and blessed day. When I come back and I get everything all cleaned up and shined up and ready, I will have more Christmas decor as well, okay? So you guys be patient with me. I'm trying. My body hurt. <laughs> I'm trying to do the best I can with what I got, baby. That's what I'm doing. So I love you guys, and I will see y'all soon. Ciao.